you're gonna have to just pull that little clip from the uh, from the old internet. Come on, boy. There's a bull, mechanical bull involved. All right. Scott Glenn's Enough about it. movies. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Here we go. I am. Hello everyone, hello. I'm Christopher. As always, the guy behind the camera is Jake. And here is a Ford F-150, 1977, four x four. This car, this truck was born, well, was raised in Arizona for many, many years. So it's a wonderful rust-free car. Yay, we love those. It's got a 351 Cleveland. It's got a four speed, two-tone blue. Uh, we have a Marty report on this truck. We've got everything on this truck. Bench seat, those wonderful 1977 gauges that they came with. It's a long bed. I love, I can run my hands down things and I don't feel any rust whatsoever. I love it. And it's beautiful. Whoa. Got a bed liner back here. The Dura liner. Dura liner. So hey, anybody who ever wants to uh, haul some drywall, bring it. Great bumper. Tail lights are in there. Look at how beautiful and blue. We got new Toyos on it. It's a gorgeous truck. It really is. 3 inch tires, pretty big. Aluminum 15 inch wheels, and then the two tone blue interior. Yes, it's a theme that goes throughout the truck, and it's wonderful. The F 150 Custom. Ooh, I'm excited about driving it. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. that first gear mm. yeah four speed on the floor and then it's your uh, four low neutral two high and four high on the floor down there as well locking hubs on the front you do have to turn the little you have to turn the hub I'm used to that I've done that many a time in my life uh, updated AM FM radio that I oh. think has Bluetooth don't quote me on it well let's not quote you uh, your door's not closed all my the door's way. not closed all the way that's better and we do have AC and heat, according to our little HVAC system there. You gotta love a good HVAC system. We're gonna system. use the heat today. Oh yes, because it's chilly and I, I, unfortunately, wore shorts. I thought I'd be okay. Wow, the gear shift is kind of far away, isn't it? It is, for a short run guy <laughs> like me. 351 Cleveland sounds good. It does. Once you start to roll it, get out of the way. You can fit anything in here. It's a pretty uh, sizable truck. Yep. It's not a small vehicle. Nope. But only a single cab, which I, I personally like. I think it's better for everybody. I like the stance, the 33 inch tires, aluminum wheels. I can actually get in it. The blue. I like blue. Well, if you like blue, this car's for you. Well, I'm right. This truck. Truck. Little Beautiful of, uh, big truck. A little bit of wood on the steering wheel. Very nice. Shifts really nice, it seems. It does. You'll For, see it when you drive it back. It's a fun one. Everything in here is in good condition too. We got a nice headliner, nothing really falling apart. The dash isn't cracked, it's in good condition. It's nicely painted the dash as well. And even all like the black bezels and stuff around the gauges look newer or at least refurbished. I mean it's pretty good. It's a great truck. It goes in a straight line. It does. This reminds me of the Bud and Sissy truck, too, from uh, Urban Cowboy. I don't know what you're talking about. You, you've never seen Urban Cowboy? No. That troubles me very much. I'm you sorry. You should see Urban Cowboy. Deborah Winger, John Travolta, Bud lived on an oil, he worked on an oil refinery. But of course, an, he was a dancer. Did they have an F-150 like you're this? You're right they did. You're going to have to just pull that little clip from the, uh, from the old internet. Come on, boy. There's a bull, mechanical bull involved. All right, Scott enough in about it. movies. Yeah, oh, it's great. This truck's very nice. It is a very nice truck. I just don't believe you didn't see that. That's no, a great, this four speed works real well. Very comfortable vinyl bench seat. But we're to our stop sign. Yes, we are. So we can see if this thing has any beans. Let this Jeep go first. Tell you what, it has torque. 
Oh, it's got torque for days. We can pull anything with this bad boy. It's like boy. a train. It's like uh, a big rig shifter. You're right. Very tall shifter, and it's very uh, pronounced. Oh, very much when so. When you're moving it back and forth, quite a long throw. It, it does, Kinda you know. Cool, though. It is cool. It accepts the uh, gear, but you got to be at the right reps. You can't short shift. It's hard to do that. No short shifting. Pardon me. I could probably start off in second, to be quite honest with you. Yeah, first gear is pretty short. And here we are in our spot. We're going to get some flybys of this thing. You're that darn right. It's going to nice take a Nice sounding dual exhaust. Oh, it does sound great. It actually I love sounds the really good. The bumper's got the rear lights in it. That's so cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm excited. You All ready? Right. You're ready, Freddy. This is a fun truck, fun to drive, you gotta drive it back. You ready? Sounds good to me. Done. 